All right, folks, we got Pac-Man. All right, let me see if I can find that. And Prince Walk is going crawl. I really like this. Chiron's on? I suppose he is. Oh, it's not up in the Chirons? I know, right? Uh, thanks to Papa Frank for that. Oh! Right. Pursuing with a fair? Aw, oh, man. Prince was a little bit far away with the F-Smash. Nice use of this, the Dolphin Blade side beat. Cherry right now is... <laughs> for content to just basically sit and let uh, Prince Walk and shit like dash back and dash in. Oh no, fair into the fire hydra, but not, no follow up. Oh, that was interesting. I was. Right now it's not letting me do the. Uh... The character tags, which is weird, because I thought I was doing it earlier. But it's okay. As long as it does the stores, I'm fine. Yeah, I'll try to do the, the, the Twitter stuff. Impossible. Oh, nice! Bell to F smash. Typical Pac-Man setup. So, um, to give you all a little bit of info about these players, uh, Cherry is a Smash Bros. player from Chicago. He's part of um, what I guess I would call Handyman's kind of Chicago hometown faction alongside uh, Chompy and Mr. Santiago, who's not playing this week. Um, Prince Waka is actually a SoCal player, repping Sam Walker College and his uh, Smash GG tag. Recently moved, and I hope the, the moving process would wound up being not new as stress. Oh, what? I didn't realize I hit Wicks that way. Oh, a nice cherry. <laughs> cherry is able to fall out of the, the startup of Prom Uppy to, to recover. That's nuts. Oh, managed to get through the Hydra and avoid F Smash. Oh. I thought Prince Walker might have thought that, that f Tilt did enough damage to get rid of Hydra, and then just um, the end lag was just enough for Cherry to get s -Mash. A couple of up airs. Oh! Nice up beat. Unfortunately, unlike Ike, they did not buff Krom up beat. Oh, getting the... Oh, I thought that was just going to be a dash attack. Prince Walker trying desperately to at least take a stock here, maybe learn something. Uh, oh. That was interesting. Oh, the bell? Again? Oh, no. For me, I thought that was going to be one hell of a bell setup. Nice. Still not enough to kill Pac-Man. Prince Walker, let me all just end it right here. Oh! It was! <laughs> I was! I was wrong. Apple to up air? Ooh, that might, that might have done it. Nice. Up here by Prince Walker. He's had success with that, but very little else. I mean, just, oh, yeah. The Chrome Upbeat could kill an idiot and give whatever we could do. <laughs> Alright, uh, that is uh, Game 1 Goes to Cherry. Let's see if this updates. Okay, cool. Alright. Hey, the Game Stores update, that's about as best as I could hope for with this. Um, I know, I mean, but here's the thing though. Chrome's the kind of character where if you start to figure out where you need to go with the hitboxes, you can easily turn it back around. Because the thing about Pac Man is. There's mix-ups in what he wants to throw, but not necessarily like uh, Chompy and Cherry were the same person. <laughs> <laughs> nope, two different people. <laughs> um, yeah, I like it too. It's, it's a lot less janky than... <laughs> <laughs> the ultimate one that actually looks like semi-professional. Hopefully Frank will stop by later. Um, Alright, game two. Let's see if Prince Walk is to be able to turn it around. Three, two, Town City here one, for game two. This is suitably goofy music for Pac-Man. Nice jab. Oh, jab, jab to spot dodge. 
Because that would be a better follow up than Spa Dodge at that point. Nice falling. Isn't able to get um, anything because Cherry Man has a shield in time. Oh, the Hydrant! Oh no! He buffered up B! Oh, that's the worst! Oh, I hate that. But hey, it's credit to Cherry for knowing exactly where that hitbox could really put the hurt on Prince Waka. And often, you know, it's just the case where sometimes if you're a little rusty. Oh man, Pac Man loops. <laughs> They're not really loops, just Pac Man's approaching aerials are deadly. The last hitbox on down air. Man. Oh! Then Cherry just completely with trampoline. Okay. <laughs> it's fine. Yeah, given everything going on, it's okay to be a little sloppy. Makes games fun. Oh! The down air lasts long enough to combat Prince Walker's attempt there. Nice side B there. Eats the apple. Uh. Oh, that hit. Okay, <laughs> I was not expecting that. Right? It's it's a little loopy. <laughs> Ice. Hey, this is the kind of action you, I've come to expect on uh, Fro Fridays. Um, I know you're doing, you, you signed up last second, but um, every Friday I tend to host a Wi Fi bracket uh, and, ho and stream matches when I can. So. Oh. The counter? Okay. Down throw to... Okay. I mean, Cherry's place in those F-Smash is kind of where you'd expect Krom to go. And the not be reversed up beat. Cherry is playing patiently and allowing Prince Waka to claim more stage. Um... I... I'm not sure. <laughs> I, don't, I don't have thoughts about that. That was an interesting exchange. Uh, no, no Jared uh, back here. Waka's gonna be tight with those confirms. So that's how Krom wins. Nice counter. Cherry's now off stage. Grab the orange. Got back. Is he gonna be able to use it well? Now he dropped it. Now I didn't. Nice dash by Cherry. Fair. Oh, did not get the continuations. Prince Waka was patient. Oh, did that eat the jump? Oh, man. This jump by Iris. <laughs> All right, and that will go to um, Cherry, 2-0. Which means all the other round one matches may begin, and I need Animals and A Breezy on stream as soon as we get out of this window. I'm going to go ahead and mark that Cherry one. 